Why, hello! It is the, uh, that time again, the third Wednesday of the month, and it is my day to blog here at the After Midnight Fantasies author's blog. Blah, blah, blah. Um, oh goodness, what am I doing? Well, I am editing. <laughs> uh, this is Relentless, which is, um, due to my editor at Berkeley on the 31st, and so I've finished um, first draft and now I'm working on um, my second draft. Well, I've, I'm doing the second draft. I did it on paper, then I will put it, in, put it in a document, then I send it chapter by chapter to all my crit partners. They in turn give me their fabulous input and feedback and send it back to me. And um, then I take some of the advice and don't take some of the advice wind it into the document, and if I'm lucky and I have time, which I try to do, I try to build up enough time in my schedule to do this, I um, then send it, the polished product, to um, my beta readers, who've been with me. Um, I have two, I have a, a variety of people who've read for me, and who read for me um, on occasion, and drop everything to do that for me, so I'm really super lucky. Um, I have two people who I just love and um, rely on their opinions and um, all my books are better because of them and literally both of them have read um, have read all my books um, except for Triad which you know I didn't have anybody really but um, Renee Meyer who many people know um, because she's awesome and she um, moderates many boards and um, is just really fabulous and supportive of romance writing and romance authors and I love her to death. And um, my friend Tracy who um, lives in Scotland and who is made of awesome as well and she has read for me since um, since A Touch of Bay actually. So she's been with me and been on my message board before I even had a book. Um, that's how awesome she is and how supportive she's been to me from the very start. So. Um, I trust their opinions and um, I like to have them read it and give me and tell me what they think um, you know before I send it off to an editor um, so yeah so that's my process and that's what I'm doing right now and I'm brain dead because of it um, because when I finish a book I just don't I lose words and I'm sort of like in a daze all the time and I I don't know if this is just me or if other people have this, have this issue on me. I'm probably just me because I'm a dork. But, um, yeah, so in the midst of all that, I've been doing other stuff. I just, uh, bring me my hookah, bring me my hookah.com, and, um, which is also www.daneheart.com. Um, is a joint effort, um, uh, between me and my lovely BFF and partner in crime, um, Megan Hart. So yeah, Dane Hart slash Bring Me My Hookah is, uh, is it all going to be a multimedia site um, that the lovely Frauke at Croco Designs created for us and uh, did, as usual, did an amazing job because um, she's amazing. Uh, oh, so yeah, so that's, that's kind of that and that's kind of where I am and that's kind of my life right now, which is just insane and busy and chaotic. And then as soon as I'm done with this, um, with Relentless, then I'm on to Outshined, which is the third book. Um, I have going to Berkeley, and uh, that one's coming out in uh, September of next year. <laughs> um, and unlike uh, Relentless and Undercover, which are futuristics, Outshined is a contemporary. So it's going to be nice to sort of switch it up. And I'm already about 11,000 words into um, Outshined, so uh, I don't have to start from ground zero like I did um, for Relentless. Um, and let's see what else. Oh, um, you might want to head on over to Amazon because there's this nifty Kindle giveaway um, featuring our lovely Beth, um, one of her Devils on Horseback books um, for free for the Kindle, um, which isn't that cool. Um, and if you haven't read her books, you really should because Beth Williamson is really cool and amazing and a great writer. And, um, and it's the start of a really great series. So if you don't have it and you have a Kindle, you should hop on over there and get it. And my book, Giving Chase, happens to be next. I am not going to say when, um, but it. But if you have a Kindle, um, Salwin is going to be giving away free copies of um, Giving Chase, which is the first in my Chase Brothers series, um, at M through Amazon for the Kindle. So um, that's pretty made of awesome, I think. Um, and I'm pretty sunned and pleased and all that stuff. So 
yay for Samhain and yay for Amazon and the Kindle. Um, uh, what else? What else? Give oh free stuff, free stuff. Let's see. Um, at at Bring Me My Hookah and um, DaneHart.com, same place. Um, you can enter a contest to win some books. Um, for me, I'm offering up. Um, either making Chase, which is the last in the uh, Chase by the series, which just came out in print, um, or What Happens in Vegas, which came out in May from Harlequin Spice, which is uh, an, uh, an anthology, contemporary erotic romance anthology set in Las Vegas. Shock, I know that title. Um, or if you have both of those, um, and thank you if you do, um, I'm um, offering your choice. You can also get a an early copy of Fated, which is my la which is my next Cascadia Wolves story, which is Megan's story, and that's coming out August 12th. I don't have my author copies yet, but I'm hoping to get them soon because it went to final. Um, and Megan is giving away a signed copy of Tempted, which is a fabulous book as well. If you haven't read it, um, she's fabulous. And so I'm off. Um, Y'all, I will see you on the uh, third Wednesday of next month of August, if I don't see you before.